Hello, Land of Killer Zombies family. This is Land of Killer re recording this video as I was unsatisfied with the original recording of this video. As a result, a lot of our zombies' noises are kind of gone from the, from the clip in some ways. I think that, that what we really have been dealing with lately, at least I have, and a lot of us on the channels I'm dealing with, is probably IRL issues. You know, like sometimes things come up where you think you know what's going to happen, you know, you think that things are going a certain direction, then then you abruptly get interrupted and shit, you know, that's kind of where I'm at. And I, I'm i doing my best to just get videos back on the channels as I am in the middle of a transitional period without giving away too many details on that. I think my main thing right now is just to try to get our videos out again on these channels one by one with um, Land of Killer, the Land of Killer show being the priority with Land of Killer Racing taking the second priority, Land of Killer Zombies taking third and then fourth probably being the Minecraft then fifth Killer Film Reviews and sixth Land of Killer Plus. I think with the channels themselves, it's going to take some time just to get back to a sense of normalcy because we've been dealing with a lot lately. At least I've been dealing with a lot. I don't know why I keep saying we. It's just been crazy. But um, I just want to sit there and just say thank you, you know, for all the support that you guys have given this channel over the last year or so that's been going and over this next year, I'm hoping maybe we'll try some some Cold War zombies or some Black Ops 4 zombies on here on occasion. I haven't made up my mind yet because for many, Black Ops 3 zombies was kind of the high point of zombies before it went and changed the formula drastically. I've only touched Black Ops 4 once and Cold War zombies once. My impressions of both were just that the, the Cold War zombies seemed like kind of weird didn't feel like zombies like I know it. The um, the other one, what is it, Black Ops 4, felt very different. The perks and everything just were totally different. I don't know what it is with the, um, with the maps and stuff, but um, that was just really, really different compared to how I was used to it. I... This video itself is going to take some time to just really come together because it's going to have to really voice over a lot of it again because um, the mic didn't really pick up my voice that well. That's one of the goals is to probably replace this mic out with something more decent when I actually have the cash on hand to do so. Because sometimes I get upset with this mic for not picking up my voice and other times it, I have effects that are turned on and stuff. I don't know. But and at the end of the day, I'm just going to keep trying to chuck along with this mic for a while. I think Mr. B's first mic was a Yeti Snowball. This this is the Yeti Nano that I'm actually using to record this in a lot of the past videos. I think my main issue with this mic is just that sometimes it just won't pick up my voice. Other times it will. I have to really enunciate what I'm saying for it to really pick up my voice and stuff half the time. It's always hilarious when you have to fiddle raw with your own mic to get stuff done. So I'm going to have to just announce it more clearly when I'm doing the videos and try to tinker out the mic settings some more so that um, my voice is actually coming through. And so we're not having some something where I have to mess with the audio gain and mess with audio settings a lot because I don't like having to do that. As it's, it's a lot more on me to get it done but if I have to I will you know for me I started out playing the Black Ops 1 zombies way back in the day and that was a lot of fun just to be able to get into it with my folks my brother and my father specifically I don't really have much uh, much else that I can um, do at the moment other than sit here and just record this Let's see what we got here Da, da, da. The question is just we have the prototype of track for this really just trying to get some of the instruments the arrangement is not final. 
So I'll notice similar sounds between this draft and references in this way. I can keep the sounds in timer, but change up the chord progression if you want a different sort of motion of song. See why, and thank you for letting me know. Okay. All right. Well, I guess you guys are in for a little treat for track 10. I guess you guys get to have a preview of track 10. All right, let's listen to track 10 together. <laughs> your preview of track 10 so yeah this is a track that's in progress right now will be the final track for the year for the channels ironically i put it out the week before stuff really got rocky i mean ironically i put it on stuff but it's going to be really good when it's finished it's going to have its own lyrics and everything really i'm really excited about it because it's going to be taking like a loan from burn a boy and three from five so that people just kind of fusing them together in some ways it should be decent. Okay, so far, just change the disco. Hopeful. Inspirational tone. Inspirational tone. And you get further, you get further along for the long. Making a track. I appreciate hard work so far on this, so far on this. <sighs> yeah, I think that track 10 is going to turn out to be really good. It's just going to take some time to really just get it, get it going, you know, it's just crazy. That's all. I don't know what else to say. It's just crazy. You know, sometimes people just want to sit there and test the, test the bounds. And you got to just be like, hey, this is what, what you got to do, what you're not going to do, you know, when you manage different things. Yeah. My biggest thing, you know, as always, you know, just treat others how you want to be treated. I don't like, I don't know how many times I need to say that, but it just seems that um, too many times in my life, people go around acting like they own everything. They don't really, really. I just got to love it when you have to deal with that. And no, I'm not really... There's nobody that really kind of annoys me more than the people that brag, I guess, if I'm being honest, but whatever. Hey, hey, hey. Look, our biggest thing on this channel is just treating people with respect, and that's what I want my subscribers to just know. You got to treat people with respect and just do the best that we can with, with what we got. That's all that matters. And I am committed to getting videos out on these channels when I have time to do so. If you don't see videos, it's likely because I don't have time to put out a video at the moment. That's usually what happens, to be very honest. And no, I don't really have any... Um, I don't really think I can... Hmm, 
I guess my biggest regret in life is, you know, sometimes not listening good enough to what people say. That's all I can really say. But, you know... Supplying the straws. Yeah, you do what you can with what you got. I'm literally going to be going out and doing the DoorDash for a long time today. Oh, man, it's going to be crazy. Even now, just re-recording this, I'm already using up time, which I could be going out and taking care of some gas or whatever, but I can easily take care of gas once I get down to where I need to. I don't know what else to say. You know, it's just crazy. I think that the biggest thing right now is just trying to grow these channels and just getting through this phase. However, I have to get through this phase and um, you guys are, you guys are amazing, all of you. I don't really say that that often, but you guys are amazing. You keep these channels going in whatever ways you can. If you want to help me out, try to get these channels to a um, thousand subscribers some way, somehow, I guess. I'll keep trucking around and getting some content for you guys. Because that's all I can do. Sometimes, you know, you just try to get by and sometimes people don't get that. I try to make an honest living with what I got, you know, and that is what it is. Sometimes people get that. Sometimes people don't get that. Whatever. You guys got to take your time to just enjoy life. That's what matters. Enjoy the content. Enjoy all of it. That's all I can say. Will we get any more sort of new channels this year? Nah. Not in the mood to make any more channels, to be honest. You do what you can, and that's all that matters. <clears throat> yeah, voice is already getting tired already because I'm having to re-record again. Because this initial recording just sounded like crap, and I was just like... No, I'm not putting out crap. I'm putting out something that's more finished and polished than than crap, you know? And um, our biggest thing with this next year is just going to be trying to figure out, like I said, new games to try. Maybe we'll get back into FNAF Security Breach if I can actually figure it out. Sometimes the objectives are really not clear in that game, and you really have to run around and go find them. I hear that there's new DLC in development, but I don't really think it would be kind of fair for me to jump over to the DLC without finishing the main story first. So, I don't know. I'll figure out which ending I'm going to sit there and go for, I guess, and just go for it. Otherwise, you know, it is what it is. A lot of you subscribe for the lead for the FNAF and I haven't forgotten about you guys I know I keep saying I'll get back in security breach the biggest barrier in security breach is that I don't know how to get to that Chica mission I don't know how to finish it at the moment that's kind of where I'm stuck so yeah I gotta figure that out you know I sometimes watch the Q37 because that guy's been going strong on his animation game for a while now Got a really good series on Five Nights at Freddy's. If you haven't ever watched it, that's something to hold you over until I get some more FNAF content out on the channel. I don't really think that we're going to do any FNAF fan games at the moment. Maybe we do one in, in the future. I got to figure out where to even find them. My hunch tells me Gaming Jolt. But I'll look around and see where, the, where those are hiding, perhaps. But I think that the biggest thing right now is just trying to get us back to a point where content comes out more regularly, where we're not dealing with all these delays. That's kind of where I'm at. 
no, I don't think that we're going to do anything really stupid, you know, like, I'm going to try to keep some, some things going, some things not, you know, kind of that sort of thing. Jeez, it's going to be, a, it's going to be almost a month before something gets out on Minecraft or killer film reviews. I'm not happy about that. That is what it is, you know, I got to get that stuff out. When you're only a solo, when you're a solo act, it takes a lot longer to get stuff together. Hoping one of these days I find some people I can partner with to really just help these channels take off a little better. Thought I found that person, but that, that is what it is. You know. Not really going to do much else, you know, as far as content for this channel for the meantime, besides this video. We're going to see if there's anything that um, really pops off in the next few that's all I can really say. There's not really any big grandiose video plan for the New Year's like I wanted to do because we're going to be very busy trying to work and all that. But, um, you know, I guess I'll say this, like, take this video, you know, and just try to remi remix it into some shorts or whatever if you want. Try to get this video out there to people, you know, kind of create shorts out of it and stuff. I don't really care if people create shorts with my content. Not going to get on you for it at all. I'll create shorts with my content when I can. Right now, I don't have time to do so because, again, busy running around doing deliveries and all that. Not really much else to really say, you know. Sometimes people just enjoy inflicting pain upon others and stuff, and they think that you don't notice it, and you're doing it's just like... I feel sorry for those people. They just don't know how to love. Love is patience and kindness. It's not about hurting people. I mean, come on. Some people just have it in them to just cause numerous things to happen and stuff. They just don't care about the damage they cause. Ah, <sighs> man. You know... I really think that a lot of us could really relate to the song Alone by Burna Boy. Like, if, you, if you're really feeling down, Alone by Burna Boy, just try that song. It's from the Black Panther Wakanda Forever movie. That soundtrack, specifically. It's really good. It's about loss. It's about pain. It's about trying to use your memories to get back into the fight. It's a really good song. And I think that, um, that you guys will really get a kick out of that if you give it a go. As for what I'll be doing after this video even records, I'll be running down to do door dashing for 12 hours and be pretty busy with that before I can even record anything from Minecraft. Otherwise, you know, I, I really appreciate all of you and I can't say that enough. The fact that I'm going back over this video again to record, I think proves my dedication to you guys and trying to put out something that's high quality and stuff. Not really a way to separate the zombies' noises out from my from my voice. I'm not that experienced with Adobe to do that, which is why I'm just voicing over all this. But um, in the future, you know, if I get better with Adobe, I'll try something like that in case something like this happens again. But um, the biggest thing now: treat other people how they want to, how you want to be treated. Golden rule, golden rule, always across all my channels. I catch somebody doing something stupid in my comment section. I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be trying to take care of that. Only so much you can do though once the channels grow bigger in size, because you get tons of comments and you can't go through every single comment as much as you'd want to. But um, happy Thanksgiving to all of you, and I'll see you on the next video. Spend that time with the family and the turkey, and just enjoy it. I really love cranberry, you know, little cranberry things you can eat, cranberry or whatever it's called, it's super good. Not really a big fan of stuffing, but dark meat turkey, man, that is my jam, I love that so much. See you next time.